What's up everybody? It's the Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video. In this video, I'm doing a deeper dive on high crop mining and how it relates to AMC. Okay? Because like I've told y'all, I look at it as a triangle. AMC, Highcroft, and Ape, since AMC owns all of those, okay? Now, I present you with a question this morning, and to think about who owns the Highcroft mine. Now, when I say who owns the Highcroft mine, some people say, uh, wouldn't Miss Diane? No, Miss Diane is the CEO hired by Highcroft mine. Who owns Highcroft mine is the question. Okay. Well, if you look over here on the chart, we'll find out that on May 29, 2020, Mudger Capital buys Allied Nevada Mine, changes its name to Highcroft, takes it public, and there is now 50.2 million common shares outstanding. At this point, Mudrick Capital owns the Highcroft mine. According to this article over here on, with Rutgers, it says Mudrick Capital, a Highcroft creditor whose special purpose acquisition company deal with Highcroft in 2020 made it the company's largest shareholder with 40% of the company. Okay, so we can add in our little note right here 40 percent of the 40 percent of the shares outstanding belong to him he owns the company then when he buys the company in May of 20 he hires Miss Diane Garrett September 8th 2020 to run the company for him and from there, we've learned of leech pads and leech pads operation and how they're uh, taking the gold from the leech pads and using it to run the mine while everything balances itself out from this acquisition. Now, I want to bring the note again. Who owns Highcroft Mine? You will say, Mudger Capital, they own 40%. However, that was in 2020. According to the Highcroft website, which is the only source you need to go to to find out who owns what percent of the company, as of August 3rd, Mudger Capital owned 24.4 million shares and they held 12.2% of the company. All right, AMC bought in and Eric Sprout bought in and they got 11.7% of the company together all right, 22% total, all right, and since he's bought in, Eric Sprout has sold off a couple of million shares and has brought his percentage down to 9.2%, okay? So we have the standing as Mudrick with 12.2%, AMC coming in a second at 11.7%, Eric Sprout with 9.2% and retail on 66.92%. All right, but this is on August 3rd and I went over here and I created this for everybody to make us be able to see it a little bit better on this chart. Who owns Highcroft Mine right now? Well, right now, as of August 3rd, it's Mudrick Capital with 24.4 million shares, 12.2% of the ownership of the company belongs to Jason Mudrick's company, MUDS, okay? AMC still follows behind at 11.7%, number two, ownership in the company. Eric Sprouts, number three, at 9.2%. BlackRock hasn't, I'm not sure about their position yet, and Vanguard took up a 1.5 million position and retail owns 66.9% of the float. All right. As of August 3rd. But that's old numbers. We need new numbers. Who owns Highcroft Mine? And it blew me away. Well, 
since August 3rd, Mudrick has sold off all of these shares on November 30th, December 2nd, December 5th, December 7th, December 9th, December 12th, December 20th, December 14th. He sold off all of this position. All right. So he now he is no longer right here. We have to adjust these numbers. And when you adjust the numbers, Mudrick falls to number two with 17.9 million shares holding a 9.21% stake in the company. And AMC now has moved up and we are the top dogs. We own Highcroft Mine with 11.7% plus warrants that we can exercise. AMC owns Highcroft Mine as of December 16th, 2022. Now with that, I'm digging even deeper than this, people, because I'm on I'm, my dog's hunting. That's all I can tell you. But I just want y'all to meditate at, on that over the weekend. That AMC is the owner of Highcroft now. And I'll talk to you in another video. Love you. Be blessed.